Three years for anyone in high school seems like an eternity sometimes, but for Elkhorn North in three years, the girls have won three straight Class B state basketball championships. The school opened its doors just 13 years ago. It's now a dynasty. Elkhorn North pulls off a three-peat and is at the top of the Nebraska basketball world. We're proud of the girls, um, their toughness, their resiliency, um, their resolve. Uh, our rebounding was phenomenal. Um, that was the number one key on the board. McKenna Murphy had four of those rebounds along with 15 points. She's a newcomer. These girls, the coaches, they just, they welcomed me. Like, it, it was awesome the way they welcomed me. And then I accepted my role on the team and here we are. So it was, it was awesome. The Wolves lost only one game all year long and it was to Scott, the very team Elkhorn North beat for the title. In that first game, we really did not play well, and we know that as a team, defensively and offensive-wise. Um, we wanted this game really bad, and we fought really hard, worked together. Um, we're a really close group this year, and um, it was just a lot of fun. Um, we got a lot of good pieces coming back as well, um, and then we'll develop some more, um, and we'll give it our best shot. Meantime, Millard South has risen to the top. The Patriots' Maya Babbitt set a state tournament single game record for the most three-pointers on Friday. And in the title game... Long three-pointer on the way, got it! More threes, that one just before the half. Then she extends the lead late in the game with another one. She pumped in a game-high 30 points to help Millard South beat Lincoln High for the Class A state championship. Congratulations, Millard South High School. So both teams make history, one with a three-peat, which is incredible, the other by ending a drought. Millard South had not won a state championship in girls basketball since 1996. They're partying like it's 1999. At the state championship tournament in Lincoln, Bill Stackis, Fox 42 Sports.